Have a nice day. How are you? I hope you're doing fine. Today, we will discuss about changes in proper fractions to mixed numbers and vice versa. Grade 4, Quarter 2. At the end of this lesson, you are expected to changes in proper fraction to mix numbers and vice versa. Before we start our lesson, let us have a sort of review of your past lesson. Let's see if you still remember. In this review, you will find the product or quotient. Are you ready? Okay. 3 times 4 equals... Correct. The answer is 12. Next, 15 divided by 3 is equal to how many? Yes, it's 5. Next, 8 times 5 equals? Very good. The answer is 40. How about 49 divided by 7? All right, it's 7. Okay, let's try another. Identify the following fractions, whether it is improper fraction, proper fraction, or mixed number. 11 halves, is this a proper fraction, improper fraction, or mixed number? Very good. The answer is improper fraction. How about 5, 6? Very good. It's proper fraction. Next, 6 and 3 fourths. All right. It is mixed number. Next, 19 fifth. What's the answer? All right, it's improper fraction. Here's the last one. Seven and two-thirds. What is the answer? Very good. It's mixed number. I'm happy to know that you showed progress in our past lesson in math. So, I am confidently will proceed to our new lesson. So, what is improper fraction? An improper fraction is a fraction in which the numerator, the top number, is greater than or equal to the denominator, the bottom number. Fractions such as 6 fifth or 11 fourths are examples of improper fraction. What is a mixed number? A mixed number is a whole number and a proper fraction represented together. It generally represents a number between any two whole numbers. Look at the given image. It represents a fraction that is greater than 1 but less than 2. It is thus a mixed number. Some other examples of mixed numbers are 3 and 1 half, 2 and 3 fifth, 5 and 3 fifth, and 4 and 1 fifth. How to change improper fraction to mixed number? Changing improper fractions to mixed numbers can help you better understand the result of an algebraic problem. Improper fractions are simply top-heavy fractions whose numerators, the numbers on top, are bigger than their denominators. Mixed numbers contain both a whole number and a fraction. To change an improper fraction to a mixed fraction, Divide the numerator by the denominator, write down the quotient as the whole number, and the remainder as the numerator on top of the same denominator. Let us see an example of this conversion. Here, 5 is the quotient and 3 is the remainder. Hence, to convert an improper fraction to a mixed fraction, divide the numerator by the denominator, write down the quotient as the whole number, and write the remainder as the numerator on top of the same denominator. So, 23 fourth converted into a mixed fraction will be 5 and 3 fourths. How to change mixed number to improper fraction? 
who change a mixed number into an improper fraction, multiply the whole number with the denominator of the proper fraction. Add the numerator of the proper fraction to this product to obtain the numerator of the improper fraction. The denominator of the improper fraction will be the same as the denominator of the proper fraction. Let us see an example to visualize it better. Let us convert 3 and 1 fourth into an improper fraction. Numerator of the improper fraction equals 3 times 4 plus 1 equals 13. The denominator of the fraction will stay the same, equals to 4. Hence, 3 and 1 fourth converted into an improper fraction will be 13 fourth. Hence, to change a mixed number into an improper fraction, multiply the whole number with the denominator of the proper fraction, add the numerator of the proper fraction to this product to obtain the numerator of the improper fraction. I hope I discussed the lesson very well. In this part, I prepared varied activities for you to perform so that your knowledge and skills in changing improper fraction the mixed number and vice versa will enhance. I know you can do it, kid. In activity one, you will go in to supply the missing numbers. Write your answer in your paper. For activity 2, change improper fraction to mixed number. Next, we have activity 3. Change mixed number to improper fraction. Remember, to change mixed number to improper fraction. To change a mixed number into an improper fraction, multiply the whole number with the denominator of the proper fraction. Add the numerator of the proper fraction to this product to obtain the numerator of the improper fraction. The denominator of the improper fraction will be the same as the denominator of the proper fraction. To change improper fraction to mixed numbers. To change an improper fraction to a mixed fraction, Divide the numerator by the denominator. Write down the quotient as the whole number and the remainder as the numerator on top of the same denominator. You are too close to finish all the activities in this lesson. For evaluation, change mixed number to improper fraction and vice versa. Let's check in this part, you may refer here to correct your answer in the previous activity from activity 1 to 3. Your answer in the evaluation part will submit to your teacher for checking the validity of what you have learned on this lesson. How was your score? Did you get all the correct answer or did you get high scores in every activity? If yes, congratulations. But if you get the score of 3 and below in each activity, don't worry. You may replay this lesson and perform again the activity religiously. Again, congratulations. You have done successfully finished the lesson.